Hi, we're here again from World Hydrogen North America. I'm here with Nora Han of ABB. Um, so we've just got a few questions to go through. Um, so just to start off, could you give some background to ABB and some of your work in the hydrogen space? Sure, um, ABB is an electrical equipment company, and as we know, electrification is kind of the backbone for the hydrogen economy, and that's really where ABB play. We support all the electrical equipment that for the downstream application, midstream transmission, and then also on the green hydrogen production. And that's actually the main reason why we're here exhibiting and talking today is how we power the green hydrogen production. What is the right electrical equipment to connect with the electrolyzer to produce the best quality hydrogen at the lowest cost? Okay, brilliant. And so you work with the electrolyzer industry. Has the 45V tax credit had an effect on work at all or has it been quite beneficial? I think that that definitely changed the dynamics of this whole market movement. You know, before, before, this, was, before this was in place, you know, a lot of activity were happening in Europe and also OEMs were very much focusing. And North America is always very much a blue hydrogen kind of market. But then once that was announced, you know, we see a lot of movement, a lot of booming in terms of opportunity. Also, people start thinking about the supply chain in North America and also the different standard. Um, and this is really something that, you know, changes in the past couple of years with 45. Okay. And so what would you say the biggest challenge has been working in the North American hydrogen market? I think the, the challenge on the one side is... You know, if you look at a market like Australia, it's a, lot, it's, a, it's a very big export market. So we actually talk a lot about green hydrogen production combined with renewables and converted ammonia and shit. And then, you know, like Europe is also very much co-located. But in U.S., I think because of this hub concept, actually you make the project really complex. I do see this crossroad. How do you establish a local ecosystem and how do you make this thing work with a hub? that actually has a pretty big uh, technical challenge there. Are you working on any of the hydrogen hub projects out here in the US? Oh yeah, yeah, we're, we're involved in, you know, many of them, you know, out of the seven, I would say four or five we're involved in, you know, doing kind of the study and understanding requirement and, and what kind of the equipment we can put together will be the best optimal things, yeah. yeah. Okay, brilliant. Well, um, thank you for your time, Nora.